Hey guys, and welcome to my second mini series for The Sims 3. Um, if you are new to my channel or have no idea what a mini series is, um, it is a gameplay series of The Sims 3 that I do after the last new expansion pack, right before the newest expansion pack comes out. Um, it's it it is a let's play, but it's kind of like a shorter version like there are not as many parts there's not 40 or 50 parts there's probably going to be less than 20 um you know because this is just me playing the game anyways um it does not focus on a specific expansion pack stuff pack uh store content item it is seriously me playing the game with all of my expansion packs installed which is all of them and all of the stuff packs installed and my store content installed. I'm not focusing on anything, just gameplay. So, with that said, <laughs> uh, you guys voted on queen.com for which world you wanted this uh, mini series to take place in, and you chose Monte Vista. Uh, Sunlit Tides came up uh, second, uh, but Monte Vista took the crown very easily. Um, I do like Monte Vista. If you don't know what Monte Vista is, it is this Italian-themed neighborhood that uh, was created by The Sims 3 store, and it is beautiful. <laughs> um, I will go ahead and make some changes to it um, in a minute, or in a bit, I guess, you know, before we start, because I definitely do like to take the neighborhoods and make them my own and do things that I would normally do uh, to my neighborhoods, just to kind of spice things up a little bit here. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and jump into create a sim. What I'm going to do is I'm going to speed through the process of creating these sims and whatnot. And uh, just because it's going to be a lot quicker, I'm going to create two sims. They're going to be friends and uh, we'll get to that in a minute. So I'm going to speed up this process here right now.
Alrighty, so we're back. I totally just made um, Molly and Whitney, and uh, this is what they look like. Yes. Um, Whit now, my little story for them is there are two friends, probably from high school or something like that, or college, you know, the university, um, and um, they just moved to Monte Vista together. Um, Molly is like, or Whitney, I'm sorry, is like, uh, the, she's like a saint, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, she's a saint. All she wants to do is find love here in Monte Vista and get married and have babies. Oh, that's like totally what I want to do. Okay. Anyways, not in Monte Vista though. I can find love in Chicago. Okay. And Molly, on the other hand, uh, with her mean mean snarl uh she is a bit of a what we would call the town whore uh she's a homewrecker all she wants to do is woohoo with all of the boys and it doesn't matter whose boy it is she is gonna woohoo with him or at least she wants to um so um i did use the mother load cheat one time so we can uh, kind of get the ball rolling it's just a little bit easier you know there's not going to be that many parts to build up, um, you know, and to make it, to make an awesome house for. Um, so I used the mother low cheat one time and we moved into this house here in Monte Vista. Uh, let's see here if I can zoom out. Yes. Uh, this is where it is, right? It's like, you know, here's like the town circle, whatever. Um, and the shops and it's kind of, it's right here. You know, it's a lot of freaking land. The house wasn't that expensive. Um, but yeah, it is a lot of uh, land. It is a beautiful house. Like I, I love the homes in Monte Vista. I really do. Um, they're so big and spacious, I think, uh, for the most. Oh, God, we already have gnomes on the lot. We can sell those darn things. Um, but yeah, so here is what it looks like. It's a lot of uh a lot of uh, gardening, farming area. Uh, it's, it's, it's nice. I, I really, really love this house. I did furnish the house. So what we're going to do is we're going to, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys um, the house here. We're going to start with the downstairs. Uh, this is just what the living room looks like. And again, I only use the mother low cheat once. So the house is not fully furnished at all. Uh, but this is the living room. Um, Seriously, the kitchen and the bedrooms are bigger than the living room. I couldn't do too much to it, but I used some stuff from Supernatural as well as the base game and Seasons and this um, record player. The, the portraits, so the photos are from Seasons. This record player here is from 70s, 80s, 90s stuff. Uh, there is another record player that comes with Generations if you were uh, interested in getting one. Uh, downstairs bathroom, just a little bathtub, all that good jazz. Here is the uh, kitchen, um, some counters and stuff from the Sims 3 store. Uh, and, uh, you know, we can't have a kitchen without uh, the... And you can't have a kitchen in Monte Vista without the wood fire oven. Um, this table here uh, and stuff, it came from the Sims 3 store. Uh, this cute little thing came from Supernatural. And, yeah. Yeah, looks nice. It looks lovely. <laughs> and going upstairs, uh, here's the bathroom again. Not fully furnished at all, but there is, you know, the essentials. And then this is going to be Molly's bedroom, just a bed because I couldn't afford much else. And this is going to be Whitney's bedroom, just a bed because I couldn't afford anything else. Okay, so that is pretty much it. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and uh, cut out here. I know this part was a little bit short. But we're going to cut out here, and uh, in part two, we will pick up on some gameplay, get some jobs, all of that jazz. I will talk to you guys later. I love you all. You all have a super fantastic, awesome, splendid, amazing day. Bye, guys.